Hi, I'm Lisa Challenger, Worcester County Tourism Director, and I am so excited to be here on the Ocean City Boardwalk today. We are going to be heading into Ripley's Believe It or Not Museum, and it is going to really surprise you. We're also heading up to the Ocean City Arts Center to talk to Rena Thaler and over to Secrets. We're visiting with Jackie and hearing from our good friend, Jungle Jim, I like to call him, Jim Rapp, our resident naturalist. So don't go anywhere. Your screen porch is always there, but you really can't use it when it's cold, windy, and rainy. Until now. With a porch protection system, you can turn your screened-in porch into a year-round casual area. No more wet furniture. No more sweeping up pollen. Look at this test. 70 degrees on the porch and only a foot away, 17 degrees outside. Choose from over 20 colors. Sold all over the USA, but made right here on Delmarva. Love your porch again with porch protection systems. Call to schedule a free estimate today. Casino at Ocean Downs. More sun, more fun than ever before. And we're turning up the heat with hot slots, video poker, and electronic table games. Plus live entertainment, live and simulcast racing, and great dining. We're just a quick spin from Ocean City, Maryland. So come to where the fun shines. Plan your trip to Casino at Ocean Downs today. 10 minutes from Ocean City in Berlin, Maryland. Hi, I'm Lisa Challenger, and I'm here with Brandon Ely, General Manager of Ripley's Believe It or Not Museum in Ocean City. Brandon, thank you for being on Beach and Beyond today. You're welcome. You're welcome. Thank you. So people have surely seen the iconic image on the boardwalk with the shark, and if they've never been in here, tell them a little bit about what to expect, because we just kind of walked through, and it's really fascinating. It, it is. It's a, it's a neat place. Um, you know, of course... The shark is the thing on the boardwalk. Uh, most every picture you see of families and uh, memories being making. That's the image. It's in there. Yep. So uh, Ripley's, uh, it's the home of the strange and unusual. You know, we, uh, it's a museum of strange and unusual facts. A lot of people didn't know uh, human oddities and animal oddities. Yeah, and so I find it fascinating because there's a little something in here for everybody. Yes. I mean, there's the weird and the gory, but there's also the artistic and the natural artifacts and... Yeah, you know, there's a lot of history in here too that a lot of people don't don't think of. Um, you yeah. Know, but like you said, it, it covers all ages and, you know, there's something for everybody. Yeah. Uh, all ages, from little bitty kids to, you know, and I had asked you earlier how long it takes someone to go through the museum, and it really, you could be here for hours. Most definitely. Yeah. Um, I've seen people, you know, take 45 minutes to go through. I've seen people spend a couple hours in here. Before. Yeah, I can see how you could do that. Okay, one of the coolest things, one of the quirkiest things, I should say, was the vending machine that you can purchase little bags of real... Insects. Um, dried insects. Yeah, you can get uh, larvits, you can get crickets, ants. Ant wings, yeah, worms. Uh, yeah, worms, you can get them in wafers, you can get them in a hard candy. And uh, it's a real, I mean, it's a real vending machine, it's not part of the exhibit. No, you can actually, mm -hmm. do people do, do people actually put their money in and uh, try them? i surprised. Uh, do they? Yeah, it, it's, it's kind of funny because people will come in, get a group of them, two or three people buy a package and Next thing you know, everybody's throwing them in their mouth. So yeah, so you see some of the things you would expect to see. You know, the freaky people and the unusual tallest guy and largest man. But there's some really cool artwork in here. Yes. The yep. metal sculpture was really neat, and we're standing, yeah, yeah, in this room with the dinosaur made out of money, and it's it it is really really cool. So tell me a little bit about um, your hours. Okay. I mean, we know you're open now. But yeah, our, 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 our season hours right now, we're op we open every morning at 9 a.m. and we uh, sell our last ticket at midnight, seven days a week. So. Midnight? Yeah. Okay. Yeah. And that is through the uh, summer? Through, through at least Labor Day. Okay. Uh, we're we're going to see how things are running when Labor Day comes around. Um, and then we're, we'll scale back a little bit. We haven't determined any hours yet. Okay. Uh, we'll just kind of play it by ear. So. And I should note that you, as as we are in here, you were mentioning all the new exhibits. So for people who say, oh, well, I've been there and I've seen it, you really have to keep coming back because they're constantly changing these exhibits and making it interesting. Yeah, that's, that's something we started here uh, at this location uh, back in February of 2017. We uh, came in, got an assessment of what we're doing, um, and start changing, moving stuff, uh, bringing in new stuff. Yeah. Uh, 
new galleries. Yeah. Uh, so you know, it's you very before. It's very it's, very it's well changed. done. It is very very yeah. well done. Well, Give us you. a uh, website uh, where people can go to get more information. Uh, you can go to the www.ripleysoceancity.com. Okay, and that's that's, right that's very very easy. Well, Brandon, thank you so much for taking the time with us today, and uh, I encourage everybody who is making a trip to the Boardwalk in Ocean City, you gotta come into this place. Hi, I'm Lisa Challenger, and we are in Snow Hill today with no stranger to anybody, I'm sure, Michael Day. Uh, Michael's the Economic Development Coordinator for the town of Snow Hill, and we thought we'd come down to Snow Hill because we all know he's done such great things in Berlin and now he's taking that same great formula into Snow Hill and if you haven't made a trip recently to Snow Hill you're really going to want to do this after watching this segment. Michael thank you well, for joining thank you. us. Who were you just talking about? <laughs> <laughs> thank you. So yeah. we're going to start right here on the beautiful Pocomoke River and we're standing right next to the Pocomoke River Canoe Company and uh, canoes, kayaks, Outboard motors, bicycles for rent, stand up uh, paddle stand boards. up paddle boards, the whole nine yards. Beautiful river out here. Uh, no mosquitoes on the uh, Pocomoke River, so it's it's great for all your water activities. And he's not just saying that; there really aren't mosquitoes there on really the Pocomoke River. Yeah. It is a it is just an absolutely beautiful river, and you can't believe how much of a wilderness experience it is when you come down here on the river. So we're going to also take a little tour of the town here in a minute and you've got some great new businesses we that sure do. have uh -huh. uh, opened up that folks may not know about. Well what we just left the candy store, the Old Town Candy Shop, uh, Paul Volcker's uh, the Green Pearl. Green, Green Pearl. The Green Pearl Art Green Gallery. Pearl, the Bishop, Bishop Stock. Stock Art Gallery. Uh, the Harvest Moon for a dinner and lunch. Blue Dog Cafe is yep. there Friday and Saturday night. So do. there's another new store, Retag, Upscale Resale. Upscale, okay, upscale that resale. works. Yep. The Sassy Girl, which is a staple here in yeah, town. Yeah, been here for a, a while. Great, great we store. went into the corner shop, which is a great another herbs. The uh, only place I buy oil and vinegar. Oil and vinegar. Barbecue rubs, um, all kinds of great things. So recently, the Daily Brew Coffee Shop so, opened, yeah. and they have uh, breakfast and lunch. Breakfast, lunch, great coffee, coffee shop. Yep, right. mm -hmm. And you. And there's also a brand new uh, rental room upstairs that you can rent for meetings or functions. And is there free Wi-Fi downtown? Yes. Okay, mm -hmm. so you can yep. hang just, out in the coffee shop, and you don't and have to have a password. Just just plug into Snow Hill Public. So we're in Toy Town, which is just an amazing store. Amazing store. You had said that there, this is probably the only store of its kind on the whole East Coast. C could be. I yeah, believe could it. Be. Yeah, could I be. absolutely believe and it. The selection and the quantity of things he has in here. You know, we're standing under a real airplane. Airplane. They could fly. How many stores have that? Have that airplane in there, yeah. Across, yeah, tell us about the shops the street, on Washington. There's a few shops on Washington Street. The quilt shop. Quilt shop. Has um, Serenity. lessons. Lessons, quilt, yeah. quilting machine, fabrics, mirror, and mirror salon. A brand new salon, which is really doing well over there. So there's shops across the street, um, and there's Plenty to do here. Yeah, when plenty you come, to do. Plenty to Absolutely. do. Absolutely. You could spend a couple hours in this store alone. Yeah. So. I should say, in addition to the museums and the historic self-guided walking tour, uh, there's there's plenty to do. Plenty to do. Yep. Give us a website so people that want to know more information might be able to go to the to find. Best one would be snowhillmd.com. Okay. That would be the easiest one. It's got all the events all on the there. Events. And well, this has been a real treat, and and this store in particular is just so fascinating. Uh, Michael Day, <laughs> thank, thank you, you. Thank, thank you, thank you. It's been fun. Yeah, it has been fun. Speed World at Jolly Roger Park on 30th Street, one of America's largest, the area's fastest and baddest go-kart tracks. And now, with the lowest prices in Ocean City, Speed World, with 10 tracks and over 500 cars featuring the cyclone, a five-story kart coaster, named by Fox News as one of the country's top new amusement attractions. Come to Speed World on 30th Street in Ocean City. Fast and furious fun for the entire family. Now, with the lowest prices in Ocean City. So standing in this room with all this unusual art at Ripley's is a great segue for our next feature on the show. We're going to be talking to Rena Thaler at the Ocean City Art Center to hear what she's got going on this week. 
Welcome to Art Matters. I'm Rena Thaler, Executive Director of the Art League of Ocean City. And we're here on the beautiful bay on 94th Street, right outside the Art Center, to see why Art Matters in Ocean City this month. So Ocean City is always a beautiful place in the summer to enjoy the views. And one of the highlights of the season is our event called Artist Paint OC, where we get 50 artists from around the country to come to Ocean City and paint in an outdoor competition for four days. I'm here with artist David Simpson, who's one of our artists in residence here at the Art Center, Good and also me. a plein air participant. And uh, David is working on a scene right now that he just painted of this beautiful shot of 94th Street. So, David, what is it that you enjoy about plein air painting? Uh, first and foremost, I, en I enjoy, you know, re representing the local scenes because I am from this area. So I, I try to do my best to, you know, represent the locals and, you know, what the beauty of this area has to offer, as well as, you know, being outside, you know, directly with the subject. It, it's, it's just a fantastic experience as far as, you know, artist and actually what you're painting as opposed to painting from a reproduction. So this event starts on August 9th. The artists will take to the boardwalk, the beaches, the bay between August 9th and 12th and pick up their easels and go out and paint. And you can watch them. You can find out where they are on our Facebook page and um, by coming down to the Art Center. And then on Saturday, August 12th from 6 to 8 p.m., the artists will gather here with their wet paintings and we'll have a huge wet paint sale that everybody can come out and be the first to collect the artwork. And then they can join us on Sunday for the quick draw. You've participated in the quick draw before. Yes, the uh, quick draw is downtown. It's the, the showing is right next to dumpsters in the inlet parking lot. Uh, the artists have basically a one mile radius, is that correct? Mm -hmm. From dumpsters there at the inlet parking lot. And you literally have two hours to make the best possible painting or drawing that you can make. Um, it's pretty invigorating. Uh, it can be a bit stressful, but it, it's really exciting. And the public tends to really like this show because it's very improvisational as far as how the work is made. It's right there in the moment, you know, and the and you that's can, on August 13th, right down on the boardwalk at exactly. South Division Street. People can come out at um, 1130 to see the judging and buy the work. They can watch the artists paint that morning from 9 to 11. So join us for Artist Paint OC, a plein air event. So there's so much to do in Ocean City, but take a break from the beach and soak up some art. Come on down to the Ocean City Center for the Arts on 94th Street and enjoy the galleries this month. We're proud to feature the work of Maryland's First Lady, Mrs. Yumi Hogan, this month in a special exhibition. And you can come and meet Mrs. Hogan here on August 18th from 3.30 to 5.30 p.m. We'll have a closing reception for her, and you'll get to meet her and, and hear about her artwork. Also take one of our classes. We have loads of classes for kids and adults all summer long. You can find us on the web, artleagueofoceancity.org, or right here on 94th Street at the Ocean City Center for the Arts. Enjoy some art, and that's why art matters. Enter a world between reality and fantasy with high-energy excitement. Lasertron, 3,500 square feet of LED special effects and action-packed fun for your team, co-workers, or family and friends. A state-of-the-art ultimate laser tag adrenaline rush for everyone with heart-pumping music, clouds of fog, and special lighting effects. Lasertron. Enjoy another worldly challenge at Lost Galaxy Golf, Lasertron, Lost Galaxy Golf, and Planet Maze, 33rd Street, Ocean City. Serena, you guys do such a great job as usual. Next, we're heading down to Secrets. We're going to be talking to Jackie, and we're going to see what's going on down at Secrets and the Distillery. Always fun stuff. Hey guys, welcome to Secrets. My name's Jackie, and today we're going to show you a little bit about our Secrets shuttle service. Okay, so there are a lot of bars and restaurants that are located on the bay, and many that you can get to by boat, but only one that will come and pick you up. And that's here at Secrets, Jamaica, USA. I'm here with Jimmy. He's the Admiral of Secrets 
shuttle fleet. He's going to let you know about our boats here. Hey, y'all. Uh, like I said, my name's Jimmy. Uh, I oversee all of our passenger shuttles here at Secrets. We have three boats in our fleet. Uh, they're 23 foot inflatable boats. They have 250 horsepower Mercury jet drive engines. They allow us to run very shallow to get you here to Secrets. Um, two of which were actually designed and built by Leighton Moore himself, our owner here at Secrets, over in Bishopville at Moore Boat. Uh, they build several types of boats, uh, shallow water passenger boats, fishing vessels, also boats for some local government as far as uh, like uh, fire department and police. You can check them out, moreboat.com. If you see something that you like, I'm sure they're accepting orders. All, right, all of our boats are operated by master captains. There's always a mate on board to ensure safe transfer of passengers to bring you here to Secrets. If you do decide to come here to Secrets, there's plenty of room, there's plenty of parking. We have 120 mooring balls out here, ranging in depth from two feet to six feet to accommodate different depths of boats. Uh, if you have a larger vessel and you want to drop your, your anchor beyond our mooring balls, feel free. We'll still come out and pick you up. Um, we'll bring you in here to Secrets. Any size boat, whether it's your personal boat or you're bringing a rental in, having some fun with friends or family. We'll come pick you up and get dinner or drinks on the bay. Day and night, how long do we run for? Uh, we run as long as Secrets is open. Uh, Monday through Friday from 11 a.m. to 2 a.m., Saturday and Sunday, 10 a.m. to 2 a.m. Um, you know, if you're a novice boater, this is a perfect place for you. There's no crowded docks for you to run into. Our captains and our mates are very friendly and knowledgeable. Uh, they'll help you approach our mooring balls. Um, always come into the wind, into the current to uh, ensure there's a trick uh, right there. Yep, to, to ensure <laughs> you, you can control your boat a little bit better. They'll help you tie your boat and secure it. Um, our shuttles run from the middle of May until the end of September. It's just a different way to experience secrets by it coming is. by the water. You may have come here before and, and come in the front door, but you know, it's just a new and different way to come experience it. And if you come here and you, hit, you decide to have a little too much fun, feel free to leave your boat here overnight and take a cab home. You know, safety is very important here at Secrets. Uh, our, our captains, our mates, our crew will make sure your boat is lit overnight and it's very secure. Uh, so and you wouldn't be the first one. No, not at all. <laughs> not at all. Uh, so come on out and, and join us here at Secrets. It's a great way to come in. You know, it's fun. Um, there's never any cover except for Memorial Day weekend by water. Um, come on out. What better way is there to come have a meal yeah. or a drink with your friends enjoy and family the beach, than by, enjoy by the boat? Enjoy the water. And enjoy Secrets. All right, guys, there you have it, Secrets Shuttle Service. Come by boat and enjoy all we have here at Secrets Jamaica USA. For our events and specials, visit secrets.com. And for more information on our boats and other models, visit moreboat.com. Secrets Distilling Company, Ocean City's first distillery since Prohibition. We invite you to travel back in time to Prohibition era for a behind-the-barrels view of Secrets Distilling Company. Learn the process by which we make our spirits from grain to bottle. Tours offered daily from noon till 6 on the hour every hour. So don't delay. Call 410-524-BOOZ. That's 410-524-BOOZ. Secrets Distilling Company, the taste worth fighting for. One of the guests came up to me and said, that was a magical experience. You just created a magical memory. I go into people's houses, I take over their kitchen, and I cook for them Italian style, I pour Italian wines, and then I play a concert afterwards, you know, by the pool or by the fireplace. When we got it all packed up, everything is clean, I said bye to everybody, hugged everybody. Uh, you know, I get in my car and actually go, yes, that was awesome. Hello and welcome to Beach and Beyond. I'm Melanie Purcell with the Greater Ocean City Chamber of Commerce and I have with me today Donna Abbott, uh, Tourism Director for the Town of Ocean City and we are here at the beautiful Sunset Park in Ocean City, Maryland overlooking our inlet and of course it's a gorgeous day here in Ocean City. We've got lots of exciting things still going on as we continue through our summer. We're about midway through. The weather has been perfect and we'd love to talk about and share a lot more about our free events that have been going on all summer and continue throughout August. So Donna, why don't you tell us a little bit about it? That's right. We've got a full slate of activities um, all for free coming up here in Ocean City for the remainder of the summer season. We have on Sundays, we had the popular Sundays in the park up at Northside Park mm -hmm. and that is a free concert and then at the end they have fireworks and of course for a small fee you can make your own ice cream sundae so not a I can't think of a better summer activity than Sundays Absolutely. in the park. Absolutely. Beautiful up there. It is. It's gorgeous. 
that it's very popular with the families that are coming into town and as well as the people who live here. Um, the other thing we have on Mondays and Tuesdays, we have free fireworks um, up on the beach uh, just off the boardwalk at around Caroline Street, North Division Street. That's every Monday and Tuesday. And then every night this summer we've had uh, the 100 Nights of Lights. That's just a light activity that's going on along the beach and boardwalk area. And families are enjoying that and kids are running around in the lights as they're sprayed out across the beach. And just another fun, free activity for the family to enjoy. Yeah, and that's something brand new this year. Um, Ocean City, we really strive to keep things new and exciting and again, continuing on with the free family activities and then also on Thursday nights right here at Sunset Park we've got the Sunset Beach Party Night so you'll have local bands out here they'll have all kinds of um, you know vendors out here it's a sponsored event usually by different nonprofits in the area such as the Chamber the HMRA so we really encourage you to come out here on Thursday nights the Ocean City Development Corporation actually puts those on for us here for free Yep, that's right, and it is a gorgeous place to watch the sunset over the bay while you enjoy the free music, and uh, they do have beverages for sale, so mm -hmm. just uh, bring your own chairs and enjoy the evening. We also have the new this year on Tuesday nights, beach dance party nights up on the boardwalk um, at the Caroline Street stage. We have DJ Batman there leading the groups, our families, in a lot of fun activities while they have music with some bands coming in from time to time, so that's a new event as well, and we're really excited Lots about that this summer. And Batman is certainly an icon here. In Ocean City, Absolutely. so everybody knows Batman. Everybody knows Batman. And of course, August screams White Marlin Open. That's so that's right. that's coming up here in August, one of the biggest events we have here in Ocean City. What is it, the largest billfish event in the nation or in the world? I think um, it is. Really, yeah. it's something that uh, has become a signature event here in Ocean City, and we are so looking forward to it. Lots of great prizes, um, even if you're just a spectator or if you are a participant. Um, it just really, the entire town comes alive with all the fishermen and all the people coming to watch. So um, down at Harbor Island, correct? Yep. That's right. We have the Harbor Island Marina every night. The nightly weigh-ins are very exciting, as well as if you want to be an early riser and get up and come down here to the inlet, you can see those beautiful yes. boats heading out every morning. So uh, we're looking forward to it. It's a really exciting week to be in Ocean City. And uh, you know, it's really part of our tradition. We are the white marlin capital of the world. Absolutely. And then this month, of course, with August, um, coming to an end we are thrilled to death to announce that this year for the first time in many many years Maryland schools are all going back after Labor Day so Ocean City is going to embrace our Marylanders and have some great promotions going on and we have a special Maryland week that I know we've been working with the town and the Hotel Motel associations and we want you to come and enjoy Ocean City August is a beautiful time of year and thank you so much Donna thank you Melanie and enjoy the summer Hi, this is Warren Rosenfeld from Rosenfeld's Jewish Deli. Yes, there really is a Jewish Deli on Delmarva. We're located in Ocean City, right on Coastal Highway. We serve breakfast, lunch, and dinner seven days a week. Come taste our real corned beef and pastrami, our knishes, fantastic Rubens, smoked fish, matzo ball soup, and all of our other dishes that will take you back to the best Jewish delis of days gone by. Eat in, carry out, or bring home some great stuff for your fridge. One visit and you'll know why we say, treat your belly to our Jewish Deli. Rosenfeld's Jewish Deli, Ocean City, Maryland. Hi, I'm Buck Elastic. When I'm in Ocean City, I fly on the extreme zip lines at Speed World at Jolly Roger Amusement Park. You've never been on line like this before. That's a wrap here at Jolly Roger Amusement Park here in Ocean City, Maryland. Are you ready for some therapy? If you're in pain or have recently had surgery, be part of our winning team and let us help you tackle your recovery. With the most innovative technology on the Eastern Shore and a top-notch staff, we'll help you blitz your pain. You have a choice where you go for physical therapy, so choose our winning team at Atlantic Physical Therapy. Visit one of our seven convenient locations. We love Atlantic Physical Therapy! We love Atlantic Physical Therapy! Hi, I'm Lisa Challenger, and we are in Berlin, Maryland today, and I'm with Ivy Wells, who's the Economic Development Director for the Town of Berlin, and we're going to be talking about all the things that are made, made right in here in Berlin. We're here at Bleach Butterfly, but you have so much made in Berlin, you actually have a list. I have such a long list, and I keep adding to it because sometimes I forget that there's so many shops that have things that are made right here in Berlin. And if it's okay with you, I would like yeah. to. I think you're going to be surprised. Can, can I read the just list? Just how much? I can yeah, read the please. list. Yes. All right. Starting with, 
Island Creamery homemade ice cream on what grounds has house-made chocolates. Uncle John makes his own soap and laundry detergent. Jeffrey arcs our hand-blown glass. Nest, she makes her own quilts and baby clothes. Burley Oak, of course, craft beer and root beer. Heart of Gold Kids, little baby clothes, very cute. Uh, Baked Dessert Cafe makes uh, all of their desserts and everything fresh each day. Tada! Uh, Patty hand paints her own wine glasses there. And I'm gonna keep going. Bee's Knees, she makes bath products, lotions, and candles. Yeah. Atlantic Retreat, chemical free spritzers and lotions and oils. Urban Nectar, so many artists, jewelry, local food, uh, Bungalow Love, there's Note Cards, and Patrick Henry Prince, and Dreamcatchers, and Jewelry, Gilbert's Provisions, he is probably fermenting something right now in his shop. We're going to go check uh, out. Yes, we're definitely going to go check out uh, Gilbert's Provisions. Berlin Farm Supply, local meat from uh, beer to beef, you have to check that out and see what that means. Painted Gourds by Joanne, CFD Fine Jewelry, and last but definitely not least, uh, the Berlin Printery. That is an amazing list, and I'm happy to say I think I've been to every one of these I places so. on your list. I hope so. So we're going to go and explore and, and go see some of these things firsthand. Let's do it. Let's join us. Thanks. So as you can see, there is so much to do and fun things to do and see, and it truly is America's coolest small town. In fact, there's so much to do that we have a few additions. A, a few additions, Wooden Octopus, Steel and Glory, and House by Salvage. Please don't forget to visit these wonderful shops here and, in America's coolest small town. And don't forget to stop by The Nest and visit Berlin's unofficial mascot. This is Petey. Petey. And Petey is very, very customer friendly. <laughs> Berlin, we are so pet friendly. pet friendly. Bring your dogs, your cats. Say your... bye, Petey. <laughs> bye. <laughs> The circus is in town, the circus is in town, and it's all free. That's right, come see the circus for free at Jolly Rogers on 30th Street featuring the Wheel of Death. Enjoy the circus with free admission and get the unlimited daytime amusement rides, one price armband, good for 1 to 5 at the pier and 2 to 6 p.m. at the park. Free admission to the circus and free parking at Jolly Rogers 30th Street location at 5 and 9.30 featuring the Wheel of Death. And save money with the unlimited nighttime ride special too, good from 7 to 11 at both locations. Jolly Rogers at 30th Street and on the pier in Ocean City. Thanks for tuning in to today's edition of Beach and Beyond. Hope you enjoyed the show. And if you're looking for more great places to visit and things to do like Ripley's, believe it or not, then tune in next time for another edition of Beach and Beyond.